We welcome you to the Ragona Off Family. It is time for evolution. So in today's video, I'm going to be speaking about reacting versus responding, and also how how those uh, those terms or those those ideas re, uh, apply to the creative aspect. So first, I'm going to like give an example of like reacting and responding. And so like when you're reacting to someone, it's usually due to like a, a, an external trigger that happens from the external world that controls you uh, internally. And you know whatever controls you, you know, ex you know whatever triggers you controls you essentially. So, you know, to get into a state where you're not controlled by like the the external is to have this this inner dialogue with yourself to judge which which actions that you're going to take, you know. And so the the best example that I have here is of of like reacting versus responding, like. Uh, you know, there's, you know, if, if someone, if you're, if you're angry at someone, you know, someone says something, you could react to that and just automatically just fight them, punch them in the face and then, you know, be done. But you, you never know what can happen through that punch in the face, you know, out of anger at, or out of react or out of like just reacting, you know, you could damage something in them. And then this could lead to like uh, an endless cycle of problems, you know, just because of the anger of not controlling you know what you wanted to do you know and, and and anger itself is not is not a negative thing it's just the fact that you let that anger consume you and it's not you know it's not you it's, you're pretty much not thinking it. you're letting the anger like think for you in, in, a, in, a, in a sense in a sense but you're not like it, it, your emotions have more control over it, over you essentially you know and so a good a good way would be to even though you are angry it would be to you know respond to that situation what would what would be a more you know logical or much more you know better approach that wouldn't cause any like future consequences later on down the road so when when you're feeling in that so when you're when you're in that state you know you may want to like kind of you may want to just remove yourself so that you can you're so that you're able to think a lot more you know clearly you know and so another example so example number two so you know crypto the crypto market and the stock market right and so you, for newcomers that, that get into crypto that get into crypto in the stock market you know when when they invest and then they see the prices are going up they get very euphoria they get very uh, euphoric uh, they're they're confident you know they, they're not they don't have any worry in the world you know their, their minds are very oh yeah we're gonna be rich etc but as soon as they see that that red that red mark that red line the, the red dip that goes down you know people start to panic you know people start to panic they, they they just lose their shit essentially you know and in this scenario if 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 you keep if if the the if the investor or the trader keeps on reacting to the market then the market is going to eat that trader out you know because you know th this is why they say not to put your not to put your emotions into the market now it's not it's not essentially that you have to be ro robotic and emotionless you know it is more so like becoming more mature as to how you, you how, how you respond you know so that's why they, that's why i say you know the difference between reacting and, and responding because like the external world or what what happened what's happening externally is what's controlling your 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 internal world and what what happens externally you know whatever whatever triggers you or whatever you know angers you controls you in, in a sense you know so it, it's time to like take back the power through responding as opposed to reacting so let's say that that red that that red bar dipped down you know usually new traders would like get the very you know have have, have anxiety you know fear and then they'll take out their money and usually they would lose money because they see the prices fluctuating up and down. It gives them a heart attack seeing, you know, their their investment go like down and then up and then down, you know. And so that's why it's 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 important to to be able to like respond to the situation as opposed to react immediately. You know, so and so like responding would be, you know, look at it from a logical logical approach. If you understand that the project or the stock that you're investing in is a very you did the research you know and it's a very good and, you, and you're looking at this from a long-term perspective you know rather the price goes up or rather the price goes down 
it doesn't really matter because long term, you know, this price is going to most likely skyrocket, you know, way further up, you know, you know, so, so it's not, it's not, a, it's not a, it's not like a, a matter of, you know, it's, it's not a matter of kind of a, kind of like when you're, when you're in this fearful, when you're, when you're in the fearful or, and, and, and anxiety, you know, mindset, uh, most likely the, the outcome that you're going to get is going to, you know, attract more fear or more anxiety within you. You know, that's why in the market, you have to be patient, you know, uh, even even with yourself, be, become patient with yourself as well. Even when, when even when it comes to the creative aspect of, 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 of art or drawing, you know, become patient as well. And also practice, uh, uh, you know, be disciplined or just just continue to to learn, to learn and learn and grow, challenge yourself, you know. And, and never be be afraid of, of trying of trying something new you know but also as you're trying something new just also be sure to to like respond you know if some if something doesn't go right in a, in a drawing you know you know just you know the more you do it you're just, it's eventually going to you're eventually going to master it but yeah just just be be able to to like respond to situations as opposed to like react immediately and so when you're when you're responding, it's more so like you're you're chilling out. Your mind is calm, and when you're in a very calm state, you most likely make better decisions as opposed to rather you're in a very fearful or anxiety state. So in a calm state, you're going to make a much more higher perspective decision as opposed to something that's like you know uh, re reactive to to like uh, whatever is going on externally. You know, so that's that would be like the difference between reacting and and responding to certain situations that, that come into your life and as you're as like certain uh, you know external you know things come into your life it's rather it's, it's a matter of, of, of perspective how, how you how, how you how you maneuver to uh, to these uh, uh, through these uh, um, obstacles so to say you know when you get when you when you when you have an obstacle when you have a challenge are you going to just constantly keep reacting to to what's happening having having like the external reality have more power over you or are you going to respond to the the, uh, the situation at hand understand it like looking looking at it from a from a higher perspective looking at it from a a, a logical perspective looking at it from a a long-term perspective will help to you know help to have you ha make better decisions you know and also looking at it from a calm relax you know non anxiety non-stressful perspective will help you make a better decision for the, the long term and uh, nine times out of ten making a decision out of fear or or stress or anxiety always ends up you know hurting the the person even even more and it, it, it keeps going on an endless cycle until the person takes you know responsibility to you know respond to certain situations as opposed to react to it and that'll be the video feel free to like comment subscribe tell me what you think about the video and uh also uh so when you sub hit the, the bell notification so that you get notified when i upload new videos and yeah, that'll be the video. Peace.